746. This one is sweet. 625. This sample is sour. Bitter and salty are also pretty well known. But the fifth one, savoury, or umami, is a lot trickier. 198, and take a couple of sips. Really focus on this one. This one is umami. When it comes to our would-be professionals, it's not a familiar one. There was one I admit that I didn't know. Um, Mumba. <laughs> that one. Is it Armani? Or like, that was a bit... Never heard of that one before. Never heard of what was it like Umagi. Well, I don't even know what that is, but I'm looking to find out today. With the familiarization over, the test really starts. They are given much weaker versions of the basic five tastes. They have to work out which is which. What makes it so difficult is that there are no other cues that we all normally take for granted. No colors, textures, smells to help them decide. No talking during this test. It's your own opinions that I want. 746. 625. Already, some candidates are finding it easier than others. Bitter and sour are often the hardest to tell apart. There were some that I thought I was OK with, but on the whole, it was quite difficult. <laughs> um, I think the umami was pretty easy to um, work out. Very difficult to distinguish the flavours. They're quite slight, very delicate. The salty was OK and the sweet. Bitter was very hard. But now tasters have to undergo a second test that they weren't expecting. They will have to identify a different variety of substances but not with their mouths. They'll be given a variety ranging from rosemary, fresh ginger, to vanilla. What I'd like you to do is write next to the corresponding three-digit code what aroma you think is in the tube. This test will be even harder than the first. Um, if you're not entirely sure what it is that you can smell, put something down that it reminds you of. You still might get a point for that. I'm normally the one that says, oh, can you smell that? And nobody else can, so let's see. <laughs> I think I've already got about half of them. Oh, it's, it's pretty good. Uh, maybe it'll be easier than the taste. Um, it's harder than I thought, actually. I haven't exactly got the actual smell, but I know what it's like. Today, only five out of the 14 were found to have the potential to go on to be a professional. That's normal for a test like this. They could be the ones who taste the food you'll have tomorrow.